don't even care about, like, well, it's not that I don't care, but you know when it's like, oh, I'm right, you're wrong, ha, 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 like, it, to me, it's more, it's like, it gets annoying to just win, like, I'm just fucking right, and it's like, you should have listened. I don't like that, like, sometimes it's really bad where, where other people, like, Sometimes it can be bad for me because you don't listen or whoever, whatever, but most of the time it's just, it can be bad for everybody and that's the whole point I try to make, really. I'm not, I'm not throwing shit in people's faces. Things just could be better if you fucking listen. <laughs> listen, you hear what I'm talking about. <coughs> Yeah, I'm drinking my coffee. Anyways, I don't have to get all specific. It's just, it's, it's an overall thing. I don't have to get specific right now about any of that. <coughs> I know I'm on the right path and I'm going to keep staying that way until that's the point. Either you're gonna realize that or you're gonna fucking fall on your ass. Anyways, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just keep on with the ducks in a row thing, whatever. Whatever the fuck that even means. You know what it means, but it's just something it's an idiom that Americans say. You know, the ducks in a row. What the hell is that? Mmm, <laughs> coffee. Anyways, yeah, I don't know what's with that anyways. Just drink some coffee and I'll make things all better. Like, I don't know, it's alright. The pals are good. I don't like to rely too heavy on the coffee, but... Just get my, my brain going here. I feel better to get the ducks in a row because, you know, I'm like, I'm confined to the house with the baby. It's not a big deal. But <coughs> I still can do everything on the phone I need to do. But, and I'm not just check everything. I took care of my bills, everything, my bills, my whatever paperwork and whatever I have to do. But I'm, we're not going to be confined to the house for all that long. Winter doesn't last forever, for one thing. I'll find a way around everything. Whether we have rides or whatever, you know, it's all... People have to help because if they don't, then they're shortchanging themselves. They're going to cut themselves off at the source. <coughs> Some people want to act like they are the source. I know I'm pretty resourceful here. Like, I can be. I'm not rich right now yet. <laughs> but you got to have one of these first. You got to utilize it to the maximum. And then, you know. Seems to be working pretty well. So that's, you know, that's where you start. You have to feel good. You can be good. You can't be evil. <laughs> if you're evil, you're just like snatching your own everything away and throwing it in the garbage. <laughs> so again, I feel good. Doing good. No problem. <laughs> I'm drinking coffee. I don't have coffee tea right now yet. So <laughs> that's the coffee. <laughs> Whatever. Just getting the the stuff going in here. Oh. It feels good though, just where it starts. 
Look at about everything. I'm not caught up in all of this. Ooh, look at me. Like, I'm caught up in doing well and making other people, not making them do Do what you want. But if you want to do well and you want to help others, if you want to just all work together like a well-oiled machine, then I'm your girl here. Not that I'm a little girl, I'm not a child, but even children can be, you know, doing this too. Anyways, let's all work together or get the fuck out of my way because you're gonna fall, you're just gonna fail. <laughs> you get it my way. <laughs> you can hate me, but it's not going to make your life any better. All this evil shit out there in the world. Uh. It's not even that, like, it's not much of an obstacle anymore if you look, if you look and see, like, open your eyes, like, there's really nothing in the way. <laughs> it's like little tiny little glitches. You just, like, kind of kick them out of the way. That's the truth, but they don't want you to know that. I don't think they know it 100% yet, but they don't want to acknowledge that. When I say they, I mean just evil people. Maybe they don't even realize that they're evil. But the whole point is, if you're not, if you're not trying to do good and look out for others and just try to be a part of something, more where we can all kind of work together just being an ass like first of all you can't look down on me because I'm not doing anything to hurt people I'm trying to I'm always trying to do more and just have something real if I'm not like, oh, here's some money, like, I don't have it all like that. <laughs> I'm like, hey, let me help you here. You can go out and do whatever. Like, make your life better. Make your day better. Make that moment in your life better, that second. That's what I'm about <laughs> in life. But if you come around here, like, try to just bring this, like, Some people I could say thank you because, like, it's just, it's, it's been good getting ready for all this, like, it's, uh, there's so much, you deal with one thing and you deal with another, but some people are truly, like, freaking evil, but they're fucking miserable, and they don't have shit. But they want you to think they have more. But they're stuck underneath somebody else's control. And they're like, I'm the fucking puppet string. And that's pretty sad. Because you can do what you want. And you can help other people. And you can just have a good life and whatever. But believe me. If you're a good person, I'm not talking about you, even if you're not perfect. But if you look down on me and don't think that I'm going to be successful, then you're not a good person like you think. And you might want to just look at your own shit, focus on fixing your shit, doing more and stop thinking like you're just entitled to things just by just existing. That's great. Work hard. Do, do things. But don't look down on me and think you're better than me when I clearly have been working hard and you just don't see that. You refuse to see that? 
that's on you. But I'm honestly, like, I can honestly say that, that I keep constantly evolving because that's my choice. It's not that I'm just entitled and I'm just saying I'm doing this or that and I'm not doing anything. No. I keep working hard on just being better and better and better. Not because I want to, like, take over the world and do some evil shit. No, that was never me. But that's clear to see. If you know me, then you know me. But Anyways, it's good. Look out for others. But take care of yourself at the same time. If you, can't if you don't take care of yourself, you can't really take care of others. you got to make sure that you're not... Don't make yourself suffer. This is why I do all of this. And why I do this. Every fucking thing that I do... I try to just do, you take things in steps and strides and whatever, do this at one time, do this at another, whatever. In the past, people kind of like me, make me look crazy and clearly I'm focused, I'm too focused. What's so crazy about being focused, you know, like, I have a psychiatrist, I have a counselor, they know where I'm at, they know that I care, we can talk about everything in detail, and it's right to the point, what's the problem, <laughs> there is no problem, <clears throat> I'm not here abusing any kind of power, I don't even want all this power, like, I don't, I don't mind sharing this fucking world with everybody, but if you think that you're going to control me, then you're knocking yourself out and you have no power. You're powerless. Me, I'm not taking it all and, you know, I can multi-manage, I can help <laughs> make sure we all have some power. How about that? that? That's where I'm at. Let's all have a little bit so we're not screwed. Like I said, don't look down on me. I work too fucking hard. I give a shit. I care too much. Don't. Just don't do that. You're screwing yourself over. Oh. Yeah, another stomach video. <laughs> this is me sitting on the chair. And, yeah, stretching. Oh. That feels good to stretch, though. You'd be surprised, honestly, like, you need to stretch sometimes to get all of the tension. Yeah, anyways, anybody should do this about somebody else, and then somebody else can do this and that. But the best thing you can do for yourself, family, your loved ones, is figure it all out. Whatever your problems are, solve them. All of that. Go in the world and take care of it all. Slowly but surely. Don't let all the problems stack up and just sit and everything and wait to have garbage. There you go, garbage. Like, no, don't do that. At the same time, you know, pace yourself. Anyways, I wanted to make some, I'll just make some videos in the future of talking about or maybe showing you different little cleaning hacks, little things, even just talking about I can do that. Okay, for example, when you want to clean your garbage can, <laughs> who wants to do that? You can take your garbage can, put some bleach cleaning stuff in it. Put it in your tub, put the blocker in, or if you have like, mine is kind of ghetto, so if you put the blocker in, it'll still go down. Anyways, you want some kind of a strainer thing, because you don't want to block up your tub, obviously. Put the cleaning stuff in it, let the shower run, and you don't have to necessarily 
scrub it, and then it eventually, when you do scrub it, it won't be super disgusting, but, but, so you see what I'm saying, like, the hot water, the hard water from the shower will, like, take it, you know, clean it out, but, just a little thought. There's different things you can do. Like, I thought about, while well, I'm talking to you guys, oh, I should just go ahead and pick up stuff off my table. There's not a lot on there, but I only have, like, a minute left on here. But, you know, just pick up a couple things here and there. While you're talking, boom, all of a sudden there's not crap on your table. I've just been, I was doing other cleaning and stuff. Like, see my counter over here. It's all organized. It looks... It's very clean, it's just, the stuff is all organized, so. Anyway, we're going to be for you in a higher body of, <laughs> like, oh my god, let me stop. <laughs> organize your brain, organize your life, do the good. Take care of yourself. Look at my beautiful hair right now. Uh, I'm just saying, it's good to take care of yourself. Have to take care of yourself. Don't look like shit. You'll feel like shit. And just take care of yourself. You're welcome. So now you don't have to hate me because you're going to take care of yourself. So all you people that hate me so much, take care of yourself. Then you won't hate me because I'm telling you to take care of yourself. Love thyself, and then you can love others. <laughs> You're welcome. Cheers.